What's going on, moviegoers? If you're new to the channel, my name is Christian and welcome to Zero Productions. You guys, we have another glass clip that was released online. Now, this is David Dunn's character versus the Beast. Now, we are literally a week away from this movie, and I'm excited. You know, forget all the bad, the bad reviews that this movie's been getting and the Rotten Tomato score. I don't care. I'm gonna go into I'm gonna go into this movie with an open mind, and knowing that I loved Unbreakable and knowing that I love Split. I have a good feeling about this movie still. I have a great feeling. I'm still very excited to see this movie. I cannot wait for Friday. You know, the, the collaboration of putting these two movies together is something big and unique. And it's very refreshing to see as well. I mean, after rewatching, you know, Unbreakable, just realizing how well that movie was made, and then Split, James McAvoy's performance in that movie, and then obviously you see the tie-in at the end of that film with David Dunn's character, and then, you know, you have Glass, you have these two worlds, you know, finally uniting, putting into this one movie. Um, it's just one big comic book movie. Um, it's, you know, how M, M, M. Night really explains how this movie is. So I'm pretty excited to see this. You know, it's something refreshing and something unique. And it's not your average comic book movie, some would say. You know what I mean? It's not your Superman, it's not your Captain America. It's something way different. But enough talk, you guys. Let's check out this clip for Glass. Where did it go? Oh my god. Oh yes. Yo, that was intense. That was intense. Yo, I cannot wait for this movie. That fight scene was fucking fun. Thrilling and scary at the same time. When they're like, where is he? This fool was on top of the fucking pipes. And you heard him like actually sounding like a beast, man. Holy shit, man. When David Dunn is to go up against the beast... They're literally going at it. How do you beat somebody that's unbreakable? How do you beat somebody that's unbreakable? Let that let that sink in. Because he can't be broken. And he's naturally strong like the beast. So I think he has one up on him. But I feel like this is the beginning of the movie. I feel like this is the second encounter he has with him when he first bumps into him. Because you know how he can bump into you or he, you know, he touches you. He can sense a presence of you know what you've done wrong and you know he first bumps into Hedwig and he's like we saw it in the trailer he's like what the fuck so he's like okay well I'm gonna follow you and then Hedwig has already kidnapped these 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 cheerleaders and you know he's getting ready for the beast to come out one night and David Dunn comes over there and stops them and then obviously they get caught well whatever happens and then they put, get put in the uh, you know the asylum but I think this is towards the beginning of the film. But I'm excited, dude. This fight was crazy. They were throwing tables at each other. Dude, these fools was jumping off walls. I can't wait. I really liked what I saw in this clip, you guys. I really liked what I saw in this clip. Ah, Friday needs to get here already. Thursday, I'm going to prep myself. I'm going to watch Unbreakable. Then I'm going to watch Split. And then come Friday, Glass. Cannot wait. Push comments down below, you guys. Let me know what you guys thought about this clip from Glass. And what do you guys think about all the trailers and clips so far for the film? How do you feel about the movie this far? And have you guys gotten your tickets? Are you excited about this movie? Post your comments down below, you guys. And thank you for taking time of your day for watching Zero Productions. Peace.